Voices of Hope for Aphasia is hosting a word play, a fun-filled night of word game competitions, dinner, and opportunities to give. Today, we get to welcome back Debbie Jonas and Marie Haley. It is nice to meet you, Marie. Debbie, it is great to see you again. Thank you for having us. Um, this is the first time. I, I was very open. This is the first time we've discussed aphasia here on the show. Mm -hmm. Tell people what it is, because I feel like once we start this conversation, then people are going to be like, oh, yes, I have heard of this. Yeah. So I think the simplest definition of aphasia is that it is an acquired language disorder. So you had language, you were talking just like anybody else normally, and then something happened and you acquired a disorder that impacts the four ways that we use language, speaking being the most obvious one, but also understanding speech, reading and writing. That's aphasia. And of course, it is in the headlines these days. Uh, Bruce Willis has a form of dementia that is, of course, related to this. Gabby Giffords with the gunshot wound. I mean, we're hearing it more and more. Yeah. Uh, and I am so grateful for it because we're hearing it more and more and we're thinking, what is this thing? But actually, right. it is very common, unfortunately. Um, a stroke happens every 40 seconds in the United States. 40% of those could result in aphasia. Mm -hmm. So it's significant. There's over 23,000 people living in the Tampa Bay area with aphasia. And of course you say stroke is the leading cause. And stroke is the leading cause. Well, Marie, I wanna go ahead and bring you into the conversation because we're kind of playing with a little bit of something that's ironic. Um, let's talk about your experience with it in your partners and how that all came together for a fun-filled night that people could take part in. We, uh, Merle was a really well-known crossword puzzle maker, probably the best in the business. Mm -hmm. And what happened was I came to Tampa, Florida we didn't intend to come to Tampa, Florida. We intended to go to Portland. But my mother got Alzheimer's disease. And because of that, Merle did two national charity crossword puzzles. And so we had a, I've had a little background in crossword puzzles and charity work for things that affect the mind. And then uh, what happened was I was approached and said, we're doing this event using crossword puzzles as the theme because it's a loss of words and language. Yeah. And uh, he said, we think it'd be really nice if you could be part of it and use the crossword puzzle. The, peop the people you know in the crossword puzzle community to submit puzzles and we'll use some of them for the event. And of course, I'm assuming uh, giving back is something that is oh, important and, oh, and jumped uh, at the opportunity. Oh, so absolutely. Merle was just the best when it came to that. He, was, he set the standard. He did two national contests for Alzheimer's disease that raised significant money. And it was done on the computer, but it was a crossword puzzle. Well, we need to raise significant money for this. Debbie, what do people need to know? How can we get involved? Is this too late to get tickets? Or let's talk about yeah. the important <laughs> stuff now. Tickets are still available. Okay, good. Uh, so the, the event is on June 8th. Uh, and tickets are available at wordplaytampabay.com. And it includes an evening with drinks and dinner and then uh, a crossword puzzle competition with a crossword puzzle created just for the event, uh, and then some other word games, uh, Wordle thrown in, some uh, word searches, and then opportunities to give and support the people that with aphasia, without opportunities to connect and um, participate in life in a supported way, I end up really isolated and I was alone. Say isolated. Yeah. You took. I was exactly thinking. Yeah. It's got to be an isolated disease. Well, we're glad you were able to be here today. It was wonderful meeting you, Marie. Debbie, always appreciate you. We're sharing the information. Wordplay, a crossword puzzle gala. Again, there's the details all on your screen. <laughs> WordplayTampaBay.com is where you can go.